Hi everyone, my name is Dr. Kayla Fulmer and I'm going to be your instructor for um, Management 545, uh, Managing Diversity in Organizations. And I am really excited to have the next eight weeks with you all to talk about ways to make organizations more inclusive and how we can better manage diversity in order to meet our organizational goals, as well as to just make workplaces generally more enjoyable, to make them more inviting and to create safe places for all of our employees. So um, as I mentioned, I'm going to be your instructor and I know this is a unique situation because most of the courses for this um, program take place in person, uh, but this course is being taught online. So I appreciate your flexibility in trying out a new format and really look forward to just being able to engage with you all about your ideas related to diversity. Um, a, a great component of this course is going to be learning about your own experiences and, and trying to take what we learn in the class and use it to make sense of your own experiences and use it to help shape your perspectives and to help you grow as an individual. So I'm really looking forward to this time together um, and I'm really looking forward to learning more about you. And chances are I might actually see you again in the future. I am slated to teach another course in the fall in person. So um, this will be a nice way for us to get introduced and then in the fall we'll be able to continue um, that connection, be able to continue that relationship. So as I mentioned, this is an eight week course. Uh, and that means that we're taking content from 16 weeks and we're smooshing it down into just eight. So um, there is, you know, a significant amount of reading involved. There will be a significant amount of writing involved. Um, one, because it's an online course. So the way that you communicate that you understand the content is by being able to share your ideas and being able to explain course concepts and being able to tie those ideas back to, um, you know, cases and real world examples. So. There will be reading involved, there will be watching some videos, watching some movies, all of that will be involved, and then writing and reflecting and, and again, uh, engaging in some analysis through some case studies to help make sense of the course concepts. So not just knowing a definition of a concept, but being able to apply it, being able to use it to make more informed decisions to make organizations more inclusive and to help them just operate more efficiently and more effectively. So we're kind of in a weird space with this eight week course is that we have one week uh, to get introduced to the course and then you have a week off for spring break, which I know you all are looking forward to and is probably much needed. So really um, to get going, you're just going to explore eCampus a little bit, follow the module to review the syllabus, kind of get an out, you know, a understanding of the layout of eCampus, um, complete the first discussion assignment and um, really review what's on the docket for this coming semester and let me know if you have any questions about um, the course content. Let me know if you have questions about accessing the case studies, anything at all. Um, one thing I do want to mention is that this semester all office hours will be held virtually and kind of on an as needed basis. So I found it really difficult to just pick one time for student hours and expect everybody to be able to make that time work given your you know varied schedules that you might have and other life commitments and responsibilities you have. So if you need to meet, I am happy to do so. I'm available most days of the week. Send me an email and then we can coordinate our schedules together. Uh, and this gives me more flexibility. I can meet you know, early in the morning, we can meet um, into the evening, whatever it is flexible for you all. Um, but I find this is a better approach than just trying to, to randomly pick you know, two or three hours a week and hoping that it works for everybody. So please don't be a stranger. The way that these online courses are going to be successful is to keep that um, communication channel open. So I will be communicative to you about what's due and sending updates and, and giving announcements. And in return, I need you to be communicative with me if there's anything you don't understand or if you have a question. Chances are, if you have a question, other people have questions too. So don't be afraid to ask. Um, this is certainly a safe place to learn and I want you to feel comfortable um, seeking out information and seeking out um, new perspectives. So thank you for being here. Welcome to our class. I'm just so thrilled to be on this journey with you all and uh, looking forward to getting to know you more in the coming weeks. So have a great uh, first week to the semester. Talk soon. Bye.